Hi, this is Hendrik and I actually am a website developer and I cater for uh, smaller businesses and for a lot of years now I've been uh, walking the streets uh, where I live in deep water and I've got about uh, 40 towns around us and we have hundreds and hundreds of websites and what I decided to do, I actually decided what I have done uh, if you look at the website where this video is I have actually put together what I call a shopping cart which is super friendly and that is for a very real reason I wanted a website that has no whistles, no complications just a basic one you could go onto the first page which you can here you just go down the page here to the categories you click on that and you go straight into the uh, buying page in the items you want to buy and then you just click into PayPal into the secure uh, website of PayPal well the, the shopping cart itself is secure as you can see by the uh, lock at the top but you've got that and you've also when you click to buy you go into PayPal and there's no need to log in at all because uh, when you order the item PayPal actually puts the uh, item your address on it so that's what I wanted I actually because of website development uh, I'm in hundreds and thousands of businesses I've visited and I can see that for smaller businesses they're not going to worry about a shopping cart so I actually put up this shopping cart that I've put on built myself uh, that over this year particularly 2012 uh, over the next couple of months the, the shopping cart should be completely filled with products starting today each day look at it and you'll see new items go on it all the time but anyway I wanted to have a safe secure website whether you're a buyer or you are a merchant who supplies items and I wanted to have a guarantee that whether you're a buyer or whether you're a merchant you can be in a position where if you change your mind you can if you want your money back you can have your money back my main web to web business if you like is glennessindex.com uh, and I have hundreds and hundreds of uh, customers and most people would not be classed as large and many of them would not be worrying about uh, shopping carts at all which I've just said earlier uh, and getting customers onto a website or onto a shopping cart is a journey by itself and in my work of course I have thousands of visitors each week so basically this shopping cart that you're looking at now plus another one which is called Tableland's Deals uh, is in the flow of the traffic now let's give you an example of this website now say you buy an item you just go on the front page you go to the categories and where you see the uh, red text it means items are available say so you go into the buying page so you buy something then you change your mind a minute later straight away you can have your money back to you straight away as soon as PayPal clears the money there's no hesitation no questions asked you can have the money back if you buy an item and you get it and then suddenly you decide you don't really want it you can actually send it back to me as well and I'll give you the money back as well it won't go back to the merchant who bought, sent it to you but it'll go back to me but I will actually give the money back to you and I will actually take care of the item myself at this website shopping um, shopping cart super friendly so that's pretty easy isn't it so if you're if you go to the website to buy something you don't have to think about your money you can just buy you can have your money back if you like if you have an item you can send it back as well who cares I want you to be able to buy here uh, with complete confidence knowing you're never ever going to lose your money and there'll never ever be a delay as well don't you reckon that's worth a lot I think it is now say you're a merchant in a business and you supply items I actually wanted you also to be in a situation where you could actually be completely confident that you're not going to lose in any way so say you put an item on the uh, on the website well as I go around I'll be uh, with the renewals now 
uh, for a business and a merchant to be on the shopping cart, you really need to have my uh, $25 website. And then if you have that, then you'll have a uh, 25 items to go on this shopping cart. Now, when customers go onto your buying page, on the left, they'll actually see a photo where they click into your uh, business and they can see that you are actually uh, a brick and mortar uh, business, a genuine business. But so for you, the business and the merchant, you basically can just put your items on there. Now, I charge 5%. Now, it's not much money. If you think about it for each dollar, you know, 10% uh, is what? 10 cents? Then if you go down to 5%, you're actually just talking at, uh, what, 25 cents? What are you talking about? 10 cents? 25 cents? <laughs> 5 cents, really? You know, let's work this one out, eh? One dollar, ten dollars is ten cents, half of that is five cents. So that's the charge would be. For each dollar, my commission is just five cents. Boy, that, that's a bit of a worry, isn't it, if I had to think about that one? <laughs> God, even not. <laughs> anyway, the commission is so small, and the reason I've got to earn something, like I've got to worry about the customers, I've got to advertise, I have to pay for hosting. Uh, if items come back, I have to... Uh, pay for that so I need to have a bit of money but I think 5% isn't much so for a merchant uh, the 5% is only on the item itself it's got nothing to do with the freight or anything etc and etc now if I'll travel around over the the, the uh, towns this year as I come to you I'll talk to you about the renewals and for every dollar you spend you'll be able to get one item so say for instance you spend a hundred dollars you can have a hundred items so you've got 500 items on the website, you just paid me $500 for 500 items uh, and then it, the item will go in the shopping cart and then uh, each Monday now I put the orders through to you. Overnight the money goes into your account and then on Tuesday you can actually start sending the items out to those that bought their item. And for you, the buyer, uh, the merchant, you don't have to worry about it at all. Once the you have once you have sent it away to the customer, if there's any problems, you don't have to worry about the item coming back to bite you. Uh, you've made your deal, you've sold your item, and that's fair enough. And if there's a problem, the item goes back to me. If it's a warranty problem, then I'll come back and talk to you, but we don't worry about it. I wanted you as a merchant, as a business owner, that you put items on the shopping cart, but you don't. Well, I don't want you to have any hassles at all. In the same way as the buyer, I want that buyer not to worry about anything. Now, you don't even have to worry about the login. No logins at all. The uh, website itself keeps uh, track of who you are. PayPal puts a, um, PayPal puts a uh, address on it, and you don't have to think about it. I actually don't like the lower logons at all. But anyway, there isn't one here. Anyway, how about that? Two things to think about. If you're a buyer, you can simply uh, go to the front page, go down the categories, click on that, you go to the buying page, you find your item, then you buy it through PayPal. If you change your mind, the money can go back to you. If you want to send the item back, you can send the item back. If you're a business and you supply an item, there's no worries for you at all. Don't worry at all. They don't have to give me a 5% commission, which is a minuscule amount of money. It's really small, anyway. I want it to be that way. But this website, really, the shopping cart I've put in, I'm really having it for customers who support with me that have over the years uh, because they've supported me and you've supported me. Now, say, for instance, you're not a customer at the moment, you can simply, uh, you'll see a link somewhere, just go and get hold of me. Uh, on the buying page, I suppose. But anyway, have a look at the website. Go on the links on the left. Familiarise yourself with the website. And then you can actually, if you're not a customer at the moment, you can just go right ahead and click in. And uh, have a $25 website. And then you can uh, put some items on the shopping cart. User-friendly. And that's what it's all about. You don't believe how difficult things are now when you travel around all these... You can have complicated websites, can't you? But I didn't want that. I want something absolutely simple. The buyer could just hop in, buy the item, nothing to think about, not have to worry about the money, not to worry about the item. They don't want the money back, they can have it back. The item to go back and go back. If the merchant supplies an item, to me, they don't have to worry about it. 
they just uh, get the order, they get their money straight away, they send the item away, and then the merchant business have to think about it. They've made a sale, which is terrific. Did you like that? <laughs> now, the biggest issue is exactly this. The whole website, the premises, if you like, I'll say for two main things, of course. If you change your mind, you want to send your items back. There is no questions asked. It all just happens automatically. It's a guarantee I'll give you. You never have to log in. You just simply go on the website and you just buy something. That's all you got to do. Two simple things. Now, one of the things that I'm actually uh, I've set up is, of course, for super deals. So uh, table uh, land deals. You'll see a link there. Uh, super deals are going up starting as I travel around now. So each week, just go back onto the website, have a look, and see what's happening. And over the next few weeks and months, you'll see the uh, items will go on. And as more items go on show, the more people will, will come. Yep. Anyway, look, as a website developer, I wanted a shopping cart that was very, very simple to use, which it is. And I wanted you to have a website that is super, super secure. And certainly through PayPal, you don't have to worry. You just basically can do your business through PayPal securely. I think that's all I need to say. I look forward to doing business with you, the buyer, and I certainly look forward to doing business with the business and the merchants who supply the items. I'll see you next time. Catch up.